When I think about ecosystem degradation and the need of ecosystem restoration, I always remember a cartoon about people living in a place virtually devoid of nature. No flowers or trees in the town. It is a love story combined with consequences of greed. The main meaning is to find a true fuller tree. The hero, a boy, finds a seed and starts to speak to citizens for the trees, while the others try to hinder him. Due to the boy, life comes back. If we change our perception and recognize nature as a great partner, we will have a great inspiration really to change the way we behave toward the planet. Nature is very resilient. It inspires with this perfection of solutions and synergies, something that we can never do. From my perspective, restoring ecosystem means bringing back the natural balance of environment that have been damaged or disturbed by human actions. Um, in order to have an effective adjustment of the uh, destructed environment, we need to have something like collective actions or collective efforts that involve our scientific research, community participation, as well as sustainable interventions. For me, there are two key words for ecosystem restoration. They are collaboration and action. For effective restoration, we need to identify why, how, when, and to whom the benefits of the restoration occurs. Successful ecosystem restoration outcomes are more likely when founded in a common vision. Coalition and partnership that works towards this vision can support joint action to scale up restoration effort. And there is always opportunity for mainstream science to reach out to larger audience, including implementers, decision makers, and supporters. Moreover, local norms and governance can be impactful supports towards restoration goals. You can all be part of the restoration effort. Uh, to me, ecosystem restoration means giving life back to the people. By rehabilitating and restoring the degraded ecosystems, we are ensuring that people can continue getting more services from their lands, from their different ecosystems, in order to better their lives. And also, it gives us a second chance against the climate change. And we can only achieve this by a review of our policies to ensure that they have environmental sustainability at heart. For me, ecosystem restoration is a process of assisting in the recovery of any kind of ecosystems which have been degraded, destroyed, or damaged. Always we have to think in a environmental aspects but also we have to think in social and economic aspects to have a successful project. I believe that in order for Ghana to achieve the sustainable development goals, we need to take restoration of the northern savanna ecosystems very seriously. This will restore most of the ecosystem services that are delivered by these savanna ecosystems, especially the woodlands, savanna vegetation and forest, and including the peatlands of northern Ghana. If these are restored, I think it will provide a lot of ecosystem services that will reduce the disease burden in the country, increase, uh, increase productivity, and also reduce the rural urban migration that is serious in the country. What is ecosystem restoration for me? It means sustainability. We are living in a world so taken by degradation and consumption that there is little room for biodiversity, so that we may have reached the point of no return. What we don't realize is that by degrading biodiversity, we are also condemning ourselves. To enhance restoration projects, we need better governance and action. Ecosystem restoration means a lot to me. First, it's part of my job. My job is to supervise natural reserves. 
Ecosystem restoration is needed in damage protected areas. Second, it means happiness. Ecosystem restoration then nature into a good cycle, so we can have good air, beautiful landscapes, delicious food, and all kinds of lovely animals. All above bring us happiness. Finally, it means responsibility. It is about everyone. It is not only the huge project, but also everyday behaviors. So let's protect our earth together.